Hey y'all, so this is a really weird intro, um, but I'm about to film a skincare routine and I really hope the audio isn't too bad in the video because if it's super echoey, I'm just going to turn it into a voiceover. So yeah, I hope you really enjoyed this video. It's been highly requested. Um, so I just figured I didn't have anything to do. I'm literally sitting at home. Um, so why not go ahead and film? I hope this isn't a weird angle either. Like I kind of feel like I should be up a little bit more. But, um, yeah. Anyways, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe before you leave. Um, I will have all of the links and product information down in the description box. And I will also have my Instagram, my Twitter, and my Snapchat information down below as well. So you can come follow me on there. So, yeah, I will have all of that information listed down below. It's so much less echoey without the door closed. Anyways, I will have all my social media linked down below for you guys to come follow me. I've been super, what is it called? Active. Been super active on my Instagram. So I really hope you guys come follow me. And yeah, we will go ahead and get into this video. Let's go. So I changed the angle of the camera. Um, messy bun and getting stuff done. That's literally my life. So basically how I start my skincare routine, I really do, I use products that I am really needing at the moment. So I don't go through a full skincare routine every single night. If I need a, if I need moisturizer, I'll put it on. Or if I need to tone my skin, I'll tone my skin. It's not a like every single day, boom, boom, boom kind of thing. Like I was saying, my skincare routine is not a everyday routine. Um, I do usually cleanse my skin the same way every single day. As far as the products I put on it afterwards, it's not the same thing every day. Um, sometimes I just cleanse my skin and sometimes I go through the whole five yards, moisturize, tone, um, do a face mask and all kinds of things like that. So I will be sharing today with you some of my favorite skincare cleansers, my favorite masks, my favorite toner, my favorite moisturizer, and stuff like that. So basically the first thing that I'll do if I am wearing makeup for the day. So if I'm wearing makeup for the day and I'm feeling super lazy that evening, um, usually I will take a makeup wipe. And I've been using just the Equate brand makeup wipes. This, These are the exfoliating wet cleansing towelettes with cucumber, aloe, and green tea. I really like these just because I like the exfoliating beads on them. Um, some other really good makeup wipes are the Avena ones, and I also really like the Neutrogena, just the original Neutrogena makeup removers. Um, so yeah, as far as makeup remover wipes goes, that's the products that I use and I would recommend. Um, so yeah. Going into facial cleansers. The favorite ones that I have been using here recently, I've kind of got them like all over my um, counter right now. The first one, if I'm not feeling lazy and I'm just going to go straight into cleansing my skin and not using a makeup remover to remove makeup, um, this L'Oreal Revitalift Bright Reveal, um, whatever this is, <laughs> exfoliating cleanser works really good at taking my makeup off. Oh my gosh, this too. Um, but it exfoliates and it removes makeup and I don't know, I've been using this for, oh Lord, I went through tubes of this. I don't even know how many I've used. Um, you can get it at Walmart. I think it's like $5.99 or something like that, but I think it re works really, really good. So I would really recommend this. Um, I've talked about it in videos before, so, um, but the other facial cleansing oil or makeup remover that I really, really love, and you guys can tell, Bosha Makeup Breakup Oil. As you can tell, I am pretty much almost gone. Um, and this is so refreshing on your face. All you do is just pump a few pumps in your hand. You take it and it takes off literally everything. Waterproof mascara, matte lipstick, it takes off everything everything and you'll just put this on your face it'll break up all the makeup you'll rinse it off with some water and then go in with your cleanser and do all your steps after that those are really two really two good 
makeup remover. This one is a makeup remover. This one is just an exfoliating cleanser that really takes off your makeup too. So yeah, I really like these two. This Mario Badescu Acne Facial Cleanser. Um, I just got this not too long ago and I talked about it recently in an Ulta haul and um, I use this pretty much every day. I'm like here. I'm already in it so I really like it and it's just a gentle cleanser it doesn't have any exfoliation beads in it or anything like that so that's really good just for like the morning time when you just want something gentle and not really harsh on your skin I would really high re highly recommend that the next cleanser I have is this Clearasil Ultra Acne Marks slash um, mask so this can be used as a cleanser or a mask I've also talked about this before on my channel, so I'm not going to go in too much um, depth with these products, but it's a really good cleanser. Um, like I said, you can't use it as a mask, so you just put it on your face and you just let it dry. And um, if you're going to use it as a cleanser, you would just use it as a cleanser and you would just wash your face with it. But yeah, I really like these cleansers. My favorite moisturizer, and this is the only moisturizer I think I've ever tried and I will probably ever use. Um, it's the Aveeno Clear Complexion Moisturizer. It's the daily moisturizer. It's the one in the little short stuffy bottle. It's not the one in the tall one. Um, I have used the one in the tall one and I honestly kind of think they work the same. Um, I think the one in the tall one has SPF in it, honestly. And I don't think this one does. So. This also says salicylic acid acne treatment helps prevent breakouts for clear, even looking skin. Um, I have nothing bad to say about this. I've literally talked about all these products on my channel before. My favorite moisturizer, and like I said, probably the only moisturizer on it. I'm really going to do a full in-depth skincare routine if I have time to do a mask and just really prep and take care of my skin. Um, the three masks that I will use, two of them, are the L'Oreal Clay Masks. Um, this one is in the exfoliation one and this one is Purify, I believe. Get these literally anywhere. I think they're like $15.99 or $10.99. I don't remember. I'll have everything listed down below so you guys don't have to worry. Um, these are like the black one as well and that one is the Detoxify, I think. I can't really remember, but these two are really good from L'Oreal. And the third face mask that I have is the Mario Badescu Super Collagen Mask. I also just got this not too long ago, and it's this really pretty, like, seafoam green, pleasant smelling <laughs> um, mask. And I just think it kind of, like, plumps my skin up a little bit and makes it feel refreshed and really clean and purified honestly then if i am dealing with a breakout the literally the best thing that i found oh let me get that toner too the thing that i found to zap a pimple or a stubborn breakout which are literally the same thing um duh is the mario badescu drying lotion love it it severely reduces the pimple overnight you just stick a cotton ball into the pink bottom and you place it on the spots that are raised and enlarged um that sounds really gross but it severely reduces them in the morning you leave it on overnight and you wake up and your zit is pretty much gone or very severely re reduced um so i really like that product i think it works really really well the toner that i use is the dickinson's witch hazel you can find this at Walmart or probably any drugstore. And this is my second bottle and I am almost done with it. I can use this every night, every morning. It just feels so refreshing on your face and I think it does reduce the look of my pores a little bit and it's just it's just refreshing. So um, I would suggest this if you're looking for it. I wanted to say thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe before you leave. If you have any skincare recommendations, please let them know. Please let them know. Please leave them down below in the comment section. Like I said before, I will have everything linked and stuff like that. Everything you need to know in the description box. If you've tried any of these products and you like them, don't like them, let me know that too. Um, also, let me know further 
video ideas. Um, I do have some videos coming out that are really exciting and stuff like that. I can't wait to share. So, yeah, if you enjoyed this video, I hope to see you in my next one. It was kind of weird because I'm just standing here in my bathroom with a really big messy bun and just kind of sharing skincare products with you guys. But, yeah, if you enjoyed this video, like I said before, smash that thumbs up button. And I hope to see you guys in my next one. Thanks for watching.